Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Thank you for stopping by. Today I have a review video and flip through of the adult coloring book Classic Farm Life by Ava Brown. All right guys, so this is a very, very, very interesting book. I found it very educational because I know nothing about a farm. <laughs> I've never been on a farm in my life, but Ava Brown is about to school me on farm life. <laughs> All right, guys, let's get right on into it. So we have Ava Brown thanking us for purchasing this coloring book here. And they say that they strive to publish unique coloring book images for all ages. So it can be for you, your child, boy or girl, your mother, your father, your cousin, your aunt, your grandma, or your newborn baby. And the newborn baby can just sit there and look at the pictures that you colored. Yes, for all ages, guys. This coloring book contains double images so that if you mess up an image or if you want to share the second half of your book with your friend or your mom or your dad or your kid you can do that you can just spread the love but guys please 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 remember to give them a five star rating on amazon because this really helps them get their book out there they also provide you with a free digital copy of this book. So you can go access that and then you can print out all the pages that you really like onto different kind of paper if you choose to and like watercolor paper or marker paper or harder, a thicker cardstock. You can do that, but hey, the paper in this book is pretty good. I wouldn't mind coloring in this book. Usually I don't like coloring in my books because I don't like the paper quality, but Ava Brown's books. I don't know if this is Amazon printed paper. If it is, Amazon printed paper has gotten a lot better because <laughs> this is very nice paper. It's just thick enough to satisfy me and it's just toothy enough for me to be happy using my different coloring pencils on it. So you can use your markers and your watercolors and all that good stuff, but make sure you always use a blotter page behind your page you're coloring. So you get the test page at the beginning, then you get into the images. Now I can say one thing about the images in this book. I really, 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 really like the line art. The line art is really thin and, and faint in this book. It's more thin and faint on some pages than on other pages, but I really like this, this technique or, or this style of line art. So you can see here, the line art is a little bit heavier, okay? And I don't mind that at all. And on here, the line art is a little bit heavier, but on other pages, the line art is very faint and you will be surprised at the different uh, results that you get when you have line art that's kind of faint and line art that's a little bit heavier. So I really like that combination of the two that's in this book. Now, it's very interesting. They have some really detailed pages in here like this one. And we have a landscape one of a tractor that is apparently being worked on because it's not running anymore. And I see that a lot. Riding down the road, I see broke down tractors all the time. <laughs> I know you're like, wait a minute, that's not, that shouldn't be part of the flip through. What are you talking about? Okay, anyway, back to the flip through. Let's concentrate. All right. So we have some more simple images where you can just kind of add your own, you know, flavor to it, especially ones like this one. You can just straight color it or you can just add a, a lot of more texture than, than what they have. They've given you room to just be really, really creative or not. You can just stick with what's here, straight color it with your markers, or you can separate each bale of the hay and, and use your tritones and give it some texture and you can just do so much. This book is very, 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 very versatile. So you got you so you have like where you can do like the background, you have the trees, you can just straight color those or you can give it so much more texture. 
That is really, really nice. And I, I really like that they gave the people actual faces. Let me bring it up a little bit closer. You see that? Some books kind of give you like, you don't really see the eyes and the nose and the mouth. And it's just kind of like, put your own in there and <laughs> just make your own face up. Now this one, I really like how we see the... We know this is an old woman. We don't have to imagine. We know that this is an older lady that's handling her apples or whatever it is that she just picked. They look like apples. So they give you that texture of the wrinkles. And oh my goodness, guys, this is just, this is so cool. And you have that cow right there. He or she a bull or whatever it is, looks like they really want to eat that flower right there because it probably tastes really, really good. <laughs> All right, here you have a kitchen in a type of cabin-like situation. And guys, oh my goodness, this picture will go perfectly with my video that if it has not already come up, is gonna be coming up very soon about how to color dishes. And I have dishes in my video just like these. So when you're ready to color this page, go and find that how to color dishes video. Go ahead on Ava Brown. Ava Brown was reading my video mine. <laughs> She's holding her little kitty cat and they're just enjoying the day. Oh my goodness. And isn't this just, it's the, the, the images in here are so realistic. You don't see that very often. And this is a unique type of line art that's in this particular book. So when Ava Brown says that they have unique images, they are telling the truth. These images are very unique. I've never really seen an artist or an illustrator and author use line art like these. It's really nice. Look at that cat. He looks like he's always getting into something. That's what his face, he even has a facial expression. I love it. <laughs> And that one over there is looking like, I'd be trying to tell him, do not jump up on the counter and mess with mom's cookies. I tell him and he don't listen to me. And he's like, I just, I just want the cookies. That's all. <laughs> oh my goodness. This has turned into a flip through and story time with Dollar Diva. Okay. All right. So we have made it to the duplicate pages. So you get a second chance to color all those beautiful images that you just saw. And guess what? The password so that you can print off your coloring pages are in the back of this book on the last page. And I'm not going to turn to that page because we don't want to get any bright ideas, do we? <laughs> All right, guys. So that's the end of this lovely, lovely book, Classic Farm Life by Ava Brown. So if you would like to get your copy, the link to go straight to this book will be down in the description below. And I hope you guys get you a copy and I hope you enjoy it because I tell you, I definitely am going to be enjoying it. So guys, thank you, thank you, thank you for watching this video today. If you enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up. If you enjoy adult coloring, please give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel, guys. Also, what do you need to do? You need to ring that bell so you won't miss another episode from the Dollar Diva. Yes, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you for hanging out with me today and you have a wonderful, wonderful rest of the day and as always, happy coloring. Bye.